Hi everyone, this is Kale. Welcome back to official channel Vidi Prog Vlogger. In today's tutorial, we will go over how to create picture in picture in video. As most commonly used effects in video editing, picture in picture could be found in live streaming, FaceTime, or video conference. Well, almost everywhere that could possibly imagine. It allows the audience to see multiple shots in the scene at the same time and deliver the image with more definition and content. In recent years, with vlogging sweeping all over the place, picture-in-picture picture seems to have succeeded establishing itself in videos, especially like beauty and fashion design, unboxing, or tutorials. This technique could make the video more fun, dramatic, and advanced. So, ready to know how to do picture-in-picture picture with the video product vlogger? Alright, so now, let's get into it! First thing first, set up video product vlogger in your computer if you haven't yet. Go check the link in the description box down below to download the software for free. And don't forget to get all the materials like the footage, audio, picture, you know, that kind of stuff ready. Alright, double click to launch your program. Select the desired resolution and frame rate. Here, I'm gonna go with default setting, 1080p and 30fps. Then, click here to import the footage and the pictures. Now we're fully set to get into the edit. One thing worth noting is that there are two types of tracks used for video here. One is a video track, another is the overlay track. While the system will exhibit automatically one video track and one overlay track as you enter the interface. If you are going to lead another track, click the plus button in the video track far left here. Each time you click it, an extra overlay track would be embedded. And as you either create or delete a video track following your requires, as we drag the videos or image down to a track here, they will unfold automatically from the bottom up. The elements on the overlay track will appear on top of the video track, which will remain at the most bottom. Now, let me show you how to quick create a video that simulates a live video game. All we need to do is to drag the cut and dried clip of the game screen from the media library to your video track down here. And similarly, drag this camera footage to your overlay track and left click this tool here. Then, go to this camera footage in the preview window. Press and hold the left mouse button and drag the corner here to resize the image. Then, left click the image and move it to a place that you want it to be, just like this. Here you have a simple simulated live video game. This technique could also be used in simulated FaceTime in a video conference with just a little adjustment on how the overlay clip plays, the size, and all that kind of stuff, you know. Here I have another similar picture-in-picture -picture tutorial in a beauty video. To begin with, still, click the video that you're going to use and drag it to a video track. And put another video, the upper laser one, to the overlay track. On top of this tube, we need a third video track to accommodate more videos. To add another overlay track, hit this plus button. Well, here, put a clip to a new track. Click the rectangle tool, like what we did before, and drag the corner and adjust the size of the clips, then the image, and the place where the clips would appear. Now you got a fashionable and easy made beauty video. All these methods could be applied to other videos with different materials replaced. Move legs. Let's try something more advanced. I want to add a frame to an image to make the video more aesthetic. Like you know, to actualize the scene when we take a selfie with some friend in the video. First. Import materials to the software, a selfie video, and a picture of a photo frame. Drag the video to a video track. Then, 
put a picture to the overlay track. But since I have some other footage I want to showcase here in the frame, I'm gonna lead another track, like what we did before. Click here. And get your video to a track. Well, the following step is pretty much the same as that of the beauty video and before. Click this rectangle tool. Adjust the image, size, place, and all that kind of stuff. Here we can notice the image in the background are too clear, which might not help get what we want for the result. Thus, we need to blur it a little bit. Go to Effect panel on the left side and find Deloys. Then, navigate to a property panel in the inspector on the right hand. Turn these values in deviation, coefficient, and threshold to the maximum and come down here to a scope panel, uncheck canvas. Then, select the video in the main track. Well, this could allow the effect to operate only in the materials on the video track. As of finishing this step, a simulated frame video is created. Alright, this is all for today's tutorial. And I think you have known how to create a picture-in-picture -picture effect in your video through these three cases. Try it out in your other video editing. If you want to watch more editing tutorial, don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We will see you soon in our next videos. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.